Hot Shell Ray topped the Billboard Adult Pop Charts in 2011 with their song Tonight Tonight, which sold over 2 million copies. Nash Overstreet says the year was filled with exciting moments, including being honored at the American Music Awards as the Sprint New Artist of the Year. You know, we released Tonight Tonight in, uh, on Valentine's Day mm-hmm. of you know, 2011, and that year just flipped for us. You know, we moved into a tour bus. We got our first award from the AMAs. Um, we played the uh, Dick Clark's Rockin' New Year's Eve mm-hmm. for, in Times Square for like a million and a half people right there, much less, you know, across the world. So we've had a really good time for the last year or so. La, 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 whatever. Despite a list of country music hits written by both band members' parents, Ryan Folesay says he and Nash chose a different direction with their music. Our parents were definitely huge pop fans, and mm-hmm. we were, you know, exposed to all of all of the pop artists of the '90s and and earlier. I mean, Nash grew up on Prince and Michael Jackson. I grew up on. We both grew up on Beatles, um, and you know, I I feel like secretly our parents want to do pop music, so it, it was just kind of it, it was never frowned upon. It was it was very very much loved and celebrated in our household. Tonight, tonight. Hot Shell Ray is on tour with pop star Demi Lovato starting in June. Ryan feels a very strong connection to their supporters for one simple reason. Our fans are the most important thing because we didn't have any for so long. And once she was working at this record label and she was going to help us and blah, blah, blah. And it went on for a long time. And the story is much more in depth, but uh, long story short, learn a lot about yourself and your songwriting and who you are and who you want to be. And this, the second album, whatever, is is us not taking life quite so seriously and just really like having a good time and and writing about real experiences that we went through versus kind of premeditated stories that might be you know not as not as.